Here, we will have a short introduce about the shape effect. The console offers shape generator for users to create exciting light shows with minimal programming. First of all, we should select group of features. We suggest not less than four pieces. So for example, we select the first group and locate them. Then we press the option effect here. Now we can see all effects are listed here. We can look for more by pressing key up or down. Besides, we can press this option and select the effect by its attribute types. For example, I want to select a position effect of circle. Now, we can see the selected effect will be listed here. And on left top here shows the feature numbers. And right top here shows the attribute type. Each effect has its attribute parameters. The first page of effect attribute, we can set the effect size, speed, and spread. The effect spread allows to change the offset size of selected features. We can press here to turn to page 2. The speed group here can divide selected feature into group. Each group of features one with the same velocity. For example, if we set to 2, then the feature will be divided into even and odd. At this moment, the spread will be disabled. The block group can divide features into groups based on the number. Each group of features moving together as one. We have to set spread first, otherwise there will be nothing changes. For example, we can set to 2, then the effect will be 1 like that. The wife controls the time a full cycle should occupy. If it is set to 15%, for example, 15%. The cycle will occupy only the first half. On page 3, we can set the origin of effects by start offset or where to stop by stop offset. The option here allows us to adjust the direction of the Effect. And on right here, we can set effect mode. It offers relative mode and absolute mode. Relative mode include center, up, and down. Then the absolute mode. Then we can realign the features one in order on selected effects by the effect order here. Now, if we want to run more effect in different type, for example dimmer, then we can select one of them to set in each different attributes. If we don't want any of them, we can select 
it and press the delete effect option. When the effect is finished setting, we can save it as a user effect. For example, save one effect on number one. And we can enter the name here and confirm to save. After save this effect, we can also relabel it. And if we want to delete the user effect, we can press delete user effect and select the one we don't want. Or we select delete all user effect. 